peace be to you. Today we reflect the stilling of the storm. It is a beautiful incident narrated by Saint Matthew. He might have taken some sources from the Psalms, especially 107 and 105, and he had reshaped it and given to the people. So, it is the teachings or instructions to the troubled church, to the church which was facing so many persecutions, problems when the church was fragile, when the church faith was weak. So, it was instruction that God was with them. So, as they were going on the boat, there was a great storm. This storm could have been raised because of the seismic waves, a strong earthquake. St. Matthew gives this word earthquake to signify the last times of the world. It is an eschatological time that God comes and saves people. So, as it was a big storm, they were troubled and the boat was tossed up and down. The people were praying to the Lord, O oh Lord, save us for we are perishing. This should have been a prayer of the church when the church was tossed by the persecutions, when the people had very little or very fragile faith. So, they asked for help and even today the church is asking this kind of help from the Lord, O oh Lord save us, we are perishing. Because of so many things, we are perishing. Because of so many individual sins and community sins, we are perishing. O oh Lord, save us. Jesus in reply to the prayer, O oh, people of little faith, this little faith in Mark we read no faith. The little faith, people had some faith, thus they had conversion, but the faith they practiced was very, very weak, a paralyzed act. So, their faith was not at all strong, very much fragile. It speaks about the second and third generations of the Christians, members of the church, who were very weak in their faith, fragile in their faith. They were not able to keep up their faith because of the teachings of the church. So, this people, it was a later members of the Catholic church, let us members of the Christian faithful. So, these people, they were saved. Dear brothers and sisters in Christ Jesus, as we are journeying towards the Father's house, our faith may become fragile when it is not practiced. When the proper food of prayer is not given to the church, given to the soul, our faith will become fragile, weak, paralyzed. And when our boat is tossed with the earthquake of seismic waves, we may 
come across so much a problem at that time we may cry lord save us for for we are perishing and jesus exhorts us to have faith let's have faith heavenly father we thank and praise you for all the gifts you have showered upon us increase in us the faith lord so that we may have very good journey towards your presence as we journey every day give us the grace lord to be faithful to your service also to have a very strong faith to the to move the mountains for many a time we are having very fragile and weak faith lord you are calling us every time o man of little faith o people of little faith increase in us the great faith lord we ask this through christ our lord amen